Hi YouTube, today I'll be sharing with this with you this new non-stick cake pan by Chef Made. Um, this pan is seven inches. It's great to make your cake mixes in or your um, own cake from scratch. You can also make Jello, custard, and all those other things. So let's open it up. Let's unbox this. So it comes in this nice, uh, sleek um, box, which is very cute. It looks great for a gift item too, this box. And it's very easy to open, no excess packing. So it's in this um, plastic wrap like so. And here it is. It's a little safety packet. And here's the label. So this is um, um, PFOA free, so it's very safe to use for your family. Um, it has it, it has been tested, so it is safe to use. So on this label, it says that it's Chef Made Certified Cooking. It's super nonstick. Um, it's durable, and long lasting, and it's very easy to clean. So this pan itself is very beautiful. It's a champagne gold color, and the, here's the design of the cake. So no matter what you make, you will always get compliments on it because it's very fancy and it looks like it was made by a professional. So if you would like to purchase this pan to make your cakes and your favorite desserts, uh, the link will be in the description box below so you can purchase it from Amazon.com. So my batter is ready, and this is the batter that I will, I will be putting in my bun cake. You can put whatever you like, but if you would like to put the one that I'm using, the, uh, the link will be in the description box below, as I've showed it in a previous video. So for the best results, I'm going to be using vegetable shortening. This is melted vegetable shortening that I'm going to be putting in every nook and cranny of this pan, and this is essential so your um, uh, cake does not stick to the pan. So I've coated almost every angle of this. I'm going to keep on doing this like so to make sure that it does not stick from any area. So now that I've coated my pan, I'm going to put in the batter. So I've put all the batter into the pan and I'm just going to even it all out. So now it's ready to go in the oven. It's all even. I preheated my oven at 350 degrees. I'm just going to pop that in and wait for it. So I just took the cake out of the oven and here's how it looks. We're going to let it cool down for a bit and then we'll flip it. So now that I took it out, I'm going to slowly try to take it out and I'm going to put my knife there so I can easily come out. This is very warm, so you must be careful. These are heat resistant gloves, so I'm going to be using those. If you'd like to buy these gloves, the link will be in the description. And look at our cake, it looks so beautiful. Look at that. It looks just like a flower. It turns your regular boring cake into this beautiful looking one. You could also put chocolate chips or something if you want something on top. You can decorate it, but I'm done. So look at our cake, how perfect it looks. Every um, design came out perfectly. And look at our pan, it's very clean. There's little to no residue in it. This shows that it, it truly is a nonstick pan. So look at our beautiful cake. It's perfect for tea time. It's very pretty, great for guests. It puts a twist onto your regular boring old pound cake. You can make it with your cake mix box or your any of your favorite recipes. So I hope you enjoyed this video, thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe if you like more videos like this. And if you would like to purchase this pan, you can find the link in the description box below.
The size of this pan is very reasonable. You're not getting a huge cake. It's nice. Or if you would like to make more cake, you can always fill it up more. Or you can buy multiple. The price is very reasonable. So it makes a great item. And it also is a great gift item for anyone you know that is a baker.